Glad to see you again, Mr. Reed. Lottie, tell me about the Wet Boot Boys. I know they've threatened you. Edwina Cox wanted me to provide her with information about Mr. Hampton's resources. I refused. Is that not dangerous? Fuck them and their lies! They claim they protect the interests of the neighborhood, but they are just greedy parasites like all the rest. I respect your courage, Miss Paxton, and I hope life will never wear you down. Dr. Reed, <laughs> you know how to make a girl blush. I am glad you came to the docks, whatever your real reasons are. Goodbye, Miss Paxton. Come now, Lottie. There is still much work to do. Hey, dude. Oh, why the long face, Doctor? What the hell happened to you? Dude, she scratched you up! What? Look at his eyes. He's got white eyes. Is he a vampire? It looks like we both have changed a lot. I must confess, it saddens me, Sean. Put your faith in the Lord, Doctor. He has a plan for all of us. We may not always see it, but he does. Since you left Pembroke, the amount of blood that has been shed, it's hard to believe you, Sean. Ask what you will. As the Lord is my shepherd, I will not speak a lie to you. He's a skull. We learned that skulls don't heal. That's why he killed her. Why return here? This is my home. These people are my flock. You will always find me where I am needed. You're gonna kill them as well if I'm not careful. Wonders never cease. Scowl managing an asylum. And what of you? A vampire doctor? Meals laid out before you? Yet you restrain? A little. And what about William Bishop? He tried to take care of you, but this hunger, this thirst, cannot be restrained. Alas, poor William. He had a good soul, but was weak in spirit. He could not shake the thirst for booze, never mind blood. But have faith. My will is far stronger than his. So he got his them from William. The guy that almost killed us at the beginning of the game, and we saved him. Right. Aren't you afraid of what you've become? We are blessed, Doctor. Can't you see it? The Lord has made us able to walk amongst the plague and aid those that need it. Do you think this is a blessing when God's own house and holy symbols repel you? If that is your burden, Doctor, so be it. But I do not fear the cross, nor am I forced to take the life of another. My kind doesn't share your imperfections. Hmm. Yeah, he does have a cross right there. Right there. I don't think I fear the cross either. I'm pretty sure it's just... When it's activated. They activate the cross, pointing it at me. But you must drink blood now to survive. No, not your scripture. Whoso eateth my flesh and drinketh my blood hath eternal life. And I will raise him up at the last day. So saith the Lord. I only need to eat flesh. No blood. That doesn't make it any better. That makes it worse, in fact. Why did you kill Miss Jones at the Pembroke Hospital? Killed old Harriet? You must be mad, Doctor. Why would I do such a thing? What? I did not see that coming. He must... Right. He must be the one, right? But you were close to her. Of course. But she was lost, separated from the fold. She did not see the hand of the divine in my blessed condition. So you claim Miss Jones' death was not by your hand, nor the other incidents at Pembroke? Though Harriet was an angry, spiteful woman, she was one of God's creatures. I have nothing but love for all he has made. People have been murdered. I've seen the blood. I don't believe you can be trusted. Have a little faith, Doctor. If you will follow, I will guide you to the light. How do you plan to do that? Take this key of the old sewers. The entrance is by the river bank, south from here. There you'll find all the proof you need. Did I find the sewers already? 
A strong key with a tag saying, quote, London East End Sewer, dash, access reserved to authorized staff only, unquote. I have to see for myself. But your sense of purpose and calm gives me some relief. I'll be here when you return. If you still think I'm a threat then, well, I surrender myself to your judgment. Really? We'll have a talk when you've returned from the sewers, Dr. Reed. Well, I guess we will. I guess we will. So, south. Oh, we were just looking. That's east. So, that's south. Yeah. People are still working at this time, while you're lot slurping soup before bed. Slurping soup before bed. What is that? <laughs> what? What is that claim? That is a goofy claim, if I've ever heard one. Okay, now, another thing is... Have things respawned because we have advanced in the main quest? And when I say things, I mean enemies, not necessarily loot. Although loot is the one that I want. Well, I guess we... The enemies... Enemies... You, call for reinforcements. you do need to call for reinforcements. Ours is to flush every hole. You shall not flush holes th this day. No flushing. It's one of them! Come at me. I order you to step back. Come on. Oh, I don't have blood. This thing is really powerful, actually. I cannot be defeated. Hmm. Just gonna make things interesting. There they are. The same fools. Hey, what's up? That is correct. And. Right now, I have a lot of blood. Stop it! That hurts. That thing hurts like hell. And it also has pretty good reach. Okay. See? It's easy. I just, uh... Well, I didn't have blood, really, at the end. Oh, wait, that's the entrance to the sewer. Let's find out how this goes. Hmm. Well, it is very dark. We're gonna have big beasts, aren't we? Potentially a new enemy. If I were designing the game, I would introduce a new enemy. Werewolves, naturally. Always werewolves. Or a big cockroach. That just... is difficult to kill. Or a big bunny. We have definitely not been here... And I don't see any enemies. There are rats. Oh! No, no enemy. It's locked. Hmm. That's the game taunting me. What do we have here? That doesn't work. That doesn't work. Oh, you actually click on it. Or or use it. And and the result is that that thing honks at me. And that's what doesn't work. How about this one? Oh? Huh? So that's it. These wheels control the water level. Boo! Boo water! Oh, water level games. My favorite. Can't go up there, though. I don't fully understand what kind of water level I'm controlling, though. 
Oh, there's another wheel here. Hmm. A little bit of a jiggle. We don't fret. And that raises the water? I... Another MP. There's a lot of these. I can't say I understand. That doesn't work. Puzzle. The water level goes down. Hmm. That doesn't work. Both of them closed. I think the water level recedes. But now that opens. But what about the secret? I can't go down. Hmm. This is giving me serious Tomb Raider Cistern vibes. The original Tomb Raider had a level called the Cistern. And it was a great level. Unfortunately, very inscrutable. Those were those were the times. Oh, lovely sounds. And special effects. It's a new creature. And I turn my back to it. Keep out is written over there. The creature doesn't want us here. So who could kill Ariet Jones? Live in a sewer. Clearly kill a bunch of people. Look at all the skulls in the, on the floor. Could it be a ghost? A were-rat? There's blood everywhere. It's a blinker skull, isn't it? I didn't see it. I didn't see what was going on. Little rat. I can't believe I'm doing this. That's the least of your concerns, mate. Can't go into the poop. I kind of wanted to go into the poop. Switch my weapon. It's going to be a boss fight, isn't it? Dead person. I don't know where I'm at. Oh. Locked door. This looks very different, though. I cannot enter. This looks really cool as well. Well! These maggots have escaped the wrath of Ascalon for too long. It is time to purge the sewers of their filth. You again. The one they call the sewer dog. Hold your tongue, newborn, or I'll crush you like a maggot. You've let the beast consume you. 
Finally! A touch of lucidity! No, I don't want lucidity to touch me. To respect the laws of Ascalon! Also, not that. So this guy is actually very susceptible to, f to blood. So he will die with this. Yeah. What is that attack? Did you turn around? I shall snap like a hair's brittle bone when you vanish. I slaughter these skulls while singing your name. Don't know if that thing hurts me. I assume it does. The hand that crushes all. Slow as a snail. Pretty slow, yeah. I don't like that. Apothecary and needles. I shall crush you. Shall you? That's way too powerful. Let's heal. Your blood is now mine. I don't think it's healing. As in healing over time. Down, stay down. Okay. That is an opening right there. Oh, that th that guy also does that. Yeah, the shadows do hit me. Your blood is now mine. This uh, upgraded offhand weapon is really powerful. It is so powerful. I, I get so much blood. Wow. Wow. We killed the sewer dog. I kind of wanted to be friends with the sewer dog. Yeah, this offhand weapon is just really, really powerful. I think it is a much better thing than than the uh, than the the saw blade or whatever it is. And I also still don't know if he was the one that killed Harriet Jones. It's locked. I think we're supposed to go this way. We still need to explore the sewers. We have rats. At least one skull escaped Fergal's wrath. Who would that be? Could it have been Sean? The 
poor creature is bleeding to death. He cannot be far. No, this is recent. Has the final hour come, Ascalon? What? Safe we are, still. Drink now. She's giving- Bless you, Bridget! This isn't the blood of a vampire, but it will quench your thirst. She's helping the skulls? Oh, she's looking at me. She's waiting. Who is she? The sewer skulls territory. What? This is our domain, not yours. You've been warned. Wait, I saved you from this creature. That must count for something. Thank you. Now go. Go back to the streets and houses. There is no love lost between us, vampire. But thank you. Please, who are you? I sense your sadness. If you must know, they call me Old Bridget, and this shelter is where we live. I'm Jonathan Reed. I'm a newborn Ekon. I'm afraid I'm not sure what's going on. I shall not bend a knee, young Ekon, but I sense your pain. Ask, and I will afford you my attention. Why was that creature after you? Fergal is the blunt instrument of the Ascalon Club. His masters would see us dead or turned into slaves if they had their way. Oh, so his name was not Ascalon. I thought Ascalon was was the name of the guy that we killed. What the hell was that thing? He wasn't an Ekon or a Skull. They are known as Volkhod, an ancient offshoot of immortals. Blood drives them, enrages them. What of this Ascalon club? Vampire society's elite in the Empire. They make the rules and enforce their judgment upon us whom they see as lessers. So is it you that Sean Hampton sent me to find? Perhaps. The sad saint was always kind to us. He must trust you if he revealed our location. Sean is a skull. All those I've encountered have been violent, crazed creatures. How can he be any different? Maybe because he is the sad saint. Or perhaps because I am old Bridget of the sewer skulls. Sean killed a patient of mine. And that's just one of the murders he's being hunted for. If you refer to Harriet, she is now among us and under our protection. Harriet Jones is alive. That's it. That's the proof Sean wanted me to find. I must talk to her. No. Harriet is not alive. But you can speak to her. I must warn you. She is fragile and may not receive you warmly. I don't understand. She is filled with bile and hate. Her mind is sharp as a tack. But her body is so weak. I've never seen its like before. She is resting in a room on the far right of this hideout. Thank you. I will bear that in mind. I wonder if she's not alive because she's a skull. <laughs> These people... They have names? Hmm. Let's look around. Look at that. Look at these body. Why are there corpses like that here? I wonder if he, if she is indeed a skull. Excuse me. Your place is not here. Well, yeah. We're at your mercy. Will you end us? Hmm. I don't think that's a plea. I think that's just despair. <gasps> Ascalon has stalked us for ages upon ages. Your smell is enticing. 
So sweet of blood. It, it's not. It's 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 poo. It is poo because I've been in the sewers. You know how it goes. But it's nice of you to say that I smell nice. Hi. How is London? I've not seen me on these walls in such a long time. I'd love to look at your face a little, but yeah. Old Bridget says you are one to trust. He says as I take his money. <laughs> oh, this. Who are you? Eternal gratitude for your protection, master. Oh, they do have a sort of a very subservient attitude. I mean, they are skulls. But that's weird. Oh, and we have a, a um, one of these places. Oh, I can't heal? Can't heal in here. Curious. We got a common mace. Now we're talking. And that's that's what I was talking about. The... Um, oh, no, no. Don't sleep. It's a bad, bad thing. Let's look at our weapons here. So, this is great. This thing is... It is... It's really good. Oh, no. The mace... The mace is a two-handed... Oh, come on. Yeah. Unfortunately, it is a two-handed weapon. And I don't want those. I've never even used one, to be fair. Let's see where she is. Is she here? Oh, Bridget. Allowed me to wander above some years back. It was unpleasant. Unpleasant. Oh, she must be here. Let's go down. Embankment sewers. I don't even know what that could mean. Rodney Grader. Excuse me. I know you. Maybe. Are you alright, sir? What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. Don't you know this is a quarantine zone? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm investigating the epidemic. You had better get to a safe place while you still can. Oh, really? Well, go investigate somewhere else and leave me be. I beg your pardon? I said go. Leave me alone, sir. Rodney, you're the man who killed that gang member, are you not? Is that why you are hiding in this godforsaken place? Yes, I did. I did not even know his name. Then why did you kill him? That arsehole always mocked me for the color of my skin. Usually I let it go. But not that night. We fought. He died. Unfortunately, I have met several murderers during my lifetime. You don't look like them. I can tell you're no cold-blooded killer. You're right, sir. At first, it was just a simple argument between us. But the man had a bad fall. Believe me, Rodney, you won't survive here long. No matter what you did, you must go back to where you used to live. I'll go back to the docks then. But if I die, remember that the blood of Rodney Grader will be on your hands. Ah, it's blood in my hands for day, for days. So Rodney has fled away f uh, after having killed a member of the Wet Boot Boys, and Rodney's crime was in fact unintentional. Hmm. He's a little bit too close for to the skulls, and he moves. I thought characters didn't move. You know, when they change places. This place just keeps going. Oh, I know where exa exactly where I'm at. And that little thing told me exactly where that was as well. 
Oh, he's just he's just staying here. Unless he's really bugged. No, no, no. He's he's probably going to leave. Uh actually, are you going to leave? I'll go back to the docks then. But if I die. Yeah. He's going to leave. 